हेलो स्टूडेंट्स लेट इज सॉल्व एग्जाम्पल्स ऑफ एक्सरसाइज सेवन पॉइंट सिक्स क्वेश्चन नंबर वन सॉल्व ए टू अपॉइंट थ्री प्लस वन अपॉइंट सेवन हियर वी हैव टू डू एडिशन ऑफ द टू फ्रैक्शन बट बोथ द फ्रैक्शन आर अनलाइक फ्रैक्शन सो टू मेक डिनोमिनेटर सेम वी विल टेक एल सी एम ऑफ थ्री एंड सेवन so if we take lcm of 3 and 7 3 ones are and 7 7 ones are and 1 3 ones are 7 7 1 1 1 now lcm of 3 and 7 equals to what we get student 21 now we will make denominator 21 21 both side so 2 upon 3 If we want to make denominator twenty one, by which number we will multiply? We will multiply by seven. Seven upon seven, two sevens are fourteen. Three sevens are twenty one. Now for one upon seven, if we want to make denominator twenty one, then three will multiply by three. Three upon three, three ones are three. Three sevens are twenty one. Now, students, we have to add these two fractions. We got both the like fractions, so we will add fourteen upon twenty-one plus three upon twenty-one. We get the like fractions now. So, denominator twenty-one is same. Fourteen plus three is seventeen. Seventeen upon twenty-one is answer. Now, next question number B. Three upon ten plus seven upon fifteen. So in number B, it is three upon ten plus seven upon fifteen. We will take LCM of ten and fifteen. Now, students, ten and fifteen. If we take LCM, we have to start with two. Two fives are and fifteen will remain same. Now we will start with five. Five ones are and three. Three ones are. So students here LCM what we are getting two fives are ten ten threes are thirty so LCM is thirty we will make denominator thirty thirty both side three upon ten so by which number we will multiply we will multiply ten by which number by three so three threes are nine nine upon thirty and seven upon fifteen so fifteen to get thirty by which number we will multiply Fifteen two size thirty, so two upon two, fourteen upon thirty. Now, students, we will add both the fractions. Nine upon thirty plus fourteen upon thirty. So we got the like fractions. Denominator is same. Thirty thirty. Nine plus fourteen equals to twenty three. Hence, answer is twenty three upon thirty. Question number C. Four upon nine plus two upon seven. So here also it's unlike fraction, and so we will take LCM of nine and seven. So let us find LCM of nine and seven. Three three zar and seven as it is. Three one zar and seven seven one one. So LCM equals to what answer we are getting? Three three zar nine. Nine seven zero sixty three. So this is LCM answer. Now what is the next step? We will make denominator on both the fraction as sixty three. So four upon nine. By which number we will multiply nine so that we will get LCM as sixty three nine seven zero. So seven upon seven. That is equals to four seven zero twenty eight upon sixty three. And two upon seven. By which number we will multiply? Nine upon nine because seven nines are is sixty three. So two nines are eighteen. Seven nines are sixty three. Now students, we will add these two fractions: twenty eight upon sixty three plus eighteen upon sixty three. So students, if we add both the fractions, what answer we are getting? For eighty twenty eight plus eighteen is forty six upon sixty three is the answer. Question number D. Five upon seven plus one upon three. So we will take LCM of seven and 
थ्री सो लेट एस टेक एल सी एम ऑफ सेवेन एंड थ्री थ्री वन झाड सेवेन वन एल सी एम इक्वल्स टू सेवेन थ्री झाड ट्वेंटी वन नाव स्टूडेंट्स वी विल मेक डिनोमिनेटर ट्वेंटी वन बोथ साइड सो फाय अपॉन सेवेन मल्टीप्लाय बाय थ्री अपॉन थ्री वी विल डू बिकॉज सेवेन थ्री झाड ट्वेंटी वन दैट वी वॉन्ट इन डिनोमिनेटर फाय थ्री झाड फिफ्टीन सेवेन थ्री झाड ट्वेंटी वन वन अपॉन थ्री मल्टीप्लाय बाय वॉट वी विल डू थ्री वी विल मल्टीप्लाय बाय विच नंबर सेवेन अपॉन सेवेन सेवेन अपॉन सेवेन सेवेन वन झाड सेवेन एंड थ्री सेवेन झाड ट्वेंटी वन नाव स्टूडेंट्स वी विल एड दीज फ्रैक्शन फिफ्टीन अपॉन ट्वेंटी वन प्लस सेवेन अपॉन ट्वेंटी वन सो फिफ्टीन अपॉन ट्वेंटी वन प्लस सेवेन अपॉन ट्वेंटी वन दीज आर लाइक फ्रैक्शन फिफ्टीन प्लस सेवेन इज ट्वेंटी टू अपॉन ट्वेंटी वन नाव स्टूडेंट्स दिस इज प्रॉपर फ्रैक्शन और इम प्रॉपर फ्रैक्शन इट इज इम प्रॉपर फ्रैक्शन बिकॉज ट्वेंटी टू इज बिगर दैन ट्वेंटी वन दैट इज न्यूमरेटर इज बिगर दैन डिनोमिनेटर एंड वील कन्वर्ट इट इन टू प्रॉप मिक्स नंबर सो वन इन टीजर वन अपॉन ट्वेंटी वन ट्वेंटी वन वन झा ट्वेंटी वन प्लस वन इज ट्वेंटी टू सो आंसर इज वन इन टीजर वन अपॉन ट्वेंटी वन क्वेश्चन नंबर ई टू अपॉन फाइव प्लस वन अपॉन सिक्स इत ई साल अनलाइक फ्रैक्शन सो वी विल टेक एल सी एम ऑफ वॉट स्टूडेंट फाइव एंड सिक्स विल टेक एल सी एम ऑफ फाइव एंड सिक्स फाइव एंड सिक्स सो वील स्टार्ट विथ टू थ्री झार थ्री वन झार एंड फाइव वन झार सो वॉट इज एल सी एम टू थ्री झार सिक्स सिक्स फाइव झार थर्टी सो एल सी एम आंसर वी आर गेटिंग इक्वल्स टू थर्टी नाव स्टूडेंट्स वी विल मेक डिनोमिनेटर एज थर्टी टू अपॉन फाइव मल्टीप्लाय बाय वॉट वी विल डू टू गेट थर्टी मल्टी फाइव विच नंबर वी विल मल्टीप्लाय सो दैट वील गेट थर्टी सिक्स सो वील डू सिक्स अपॉन सिक्स टू सिक्स झार ट्वेल्व फाइव सिक्स झार थर्टी नाव वन अपॉन सिक्स बाय विच नंबर वी विल मल्टीप्लाय सिक्स बाय विच नंबर वील मल्टीप्लाय फाइव सो फाइव अपॉन फाइव वन फाइव झा फाइव सिक्स फाइव झा थर्टी नाव वी गेट बोथ द लाइक फ्रैक्शन सो नाव वी हैव टू एड बोथ द लाइक फ्रैक्शन दैट इज ट्वेल्व अपॉन थर्टी प्लस वॉट वी वेर गेटिंग नेक्स्ट इज फाइव अपॉन थर्टी दीज आर लाइक फ्रैक्शन डिनोमिनेटर इज सेम सो यर थर्टी ट्वेल्व प्लस फाइव इज सेवेंटीन so answer is therefore answer is 17 upon 30 and this is proper fraction so answer will remain 17 upon 30 question number f 4 upon 5 plus 2 upon 3 these are li unlike fractions so again we will take lcm of 5 and 3 so if we take lcm of 5 and 3 3 वन झार फाइव वन झार सो वॉट इज एल सी एम इक्वल्स टू थ्री फाइव झार फिफ्टीन नाव वी विल मेक डिनोमिनेटर फिफ्टीन सो फोर अपॉन फाइव बाय फाइव विच नंबर वी विल मल्टीप्लाय थ्री अपॉन थ्री बिकॉज फाइव थ्री झार इज फिफ्टीन सो यर फोर थ्री झार ट्वेल्व फाइव थ्री झार फिफ्टीन देन वी विल टेक टू अपॉन थ्री बाय थ्री विच नंबर वी विल मल्टीप्लाय सो दैट वी गेट फिफ्टीन फाइव So we will do five upon five, two five is a ten, three five is a fifteen. Now addition sign is there, so we will add both the fractions. Twelve upon fifteen plus ten upon fifteen. Now students, here twelve plus these are like fractions, so denominator is same. That is fifteen. Twelve plus ten is twenty-two. Twenty-two upon fifteen. Again, this is improper fraction. so we will convert it into mixed number hence the answer hence if we convert it into mixed number then one integer 7 upon 15 15 ones are 15 plus 7 22 upon 15 now students have we were doing this by dividing you can divide 22 by 15 15 ones are 15 and 22 minus 15 is 7 now number g in number g also what is the question 3 upon 4 minus 1 upon 3 we will take first of our lcm of 4 and 3 so let us take lcm of 3 and 
टू टू जैर देन टू वन जैर देन थ्री वन जैर सो वॉट इज द एल सी एम आंसर वी आर गेटिंग एल सी एम वी आर गेटिंग इज टू टू जै फोर थ्री जै ट्वेल्व सो इयर वी विल राइट एल सी एम इक्वल्स टू ट्वेल्व नाउ स्टूडेंट्स वील मेक डिनोमिनेटर एज ट्वेल्व थ्री अपॉन फोर सो मल्टीप्लाइंग बाय फोर बाय विच नंबर वी विल मल्टीप्लाई थ्री अपॉन थ्री सो दिस इज नाइन अपॉन ट्वेल्व सिमिलरली फॉर वन अपॉन थ्री बाय थ्री विच नंबर वी विल मल्टीप्लाई फोर सो फोर फोर अपॉन फोर फोर वन फोर जै फोर एंड थ्री फोर जै ट्वेल्व सो वी गेट नाइन अपॉन ट्वेल्व एंड फोर अपॉन ट्वेल्व नाउ विच साइन इज इयर सब्ट्रैक्शन सो वी विल सब्ट्रैक्ट इट सो इयर वी विल राइट नाइन अपॉन ट्वेल्व माइनस फोर अपॉन ट्वेल्व सो नाउ स्टूडेंट्स एज वी आर गेटिंग नाइन अपॉन फोर नाइन अपॉन ट्वेल्व माइनस फोर अपॉन ट्वेल्व दे आर लाइक फ्रैक्शन सो नाइन माइनस फोर एंड दैट इज इक्वल्स टू फाइव अपॉन ट्वेल्व सो आंसर वी आर गेटिंग इज फाइव अपॉन ट्वेल्व क्वेश्चन नंबर एच फाइव अपॉन सिक्स माइनस वन अपॉन थ्री सो इयर वी विल टेक एल सी एम ऑफ थ्री एंड सिक्स सो इफ वी टेक एल सी एम ऑफ थ्री एंड सिक्स टू थ्री जै थ्री वन जै सो एल सी एम इक्वल्स टू सिक्स वी गेट नाउ स्टूडेंट्स फाइव अपॉन सिक्स इयर सिक्स इज ऑलरेडी देर इन डिनोमिनेटर सो वी विल मेक दिस वन अपॉन थ्री एय सिक्स सो वन अपॉन थ्री मल्टीप्लाई बाय वॉट वी विल डू टू and 2 2 upon 2 2 1 2 2 3 is 6 now what are the two fractions that is 5 upon 6 minus 2 upon 6 we get the like fractions so denominator same 5 minus 2 that is equals to 3 upon 6 now students here we are 3 upon 6 we have to convert this into simplest form of the fraction so here 3 1s are and 3 2s are answer is 1 upon Two. Question number I. Two upon three plus three upon four plus one upon two. Now here three unlike fractions are there. So we will take LCM of all three denominator three, four, and two. So now students, if we take LCM three, four, two. Let us find the LCM two, three, two, two zero and one, two, one, one, three, one, one. So what is the LCM answer we are getting? Two two is a four, four three is a twelve. So LCM is twelve. We will make all three denominators as twelve. So two upon three multiply by what we will do? Four upon four, two four is a eight, three four is a twelve. Similarly for three upon four, what we will do? By four which number we will multiply? We will multiply by three. So Three upon three, that is nine upon twelve, and for one upon two, by two which number we will multiply? Six upon six. Six ones are six. Six twos are twelve. Now we will add all three fractions. Eight upon twelve plus nine upon twelve plus six upon twelve. We have to add all three fractions. So these are like fractions. So twelve. Eight plus nine plus six. If we add all these numbers, then it is twenty-three upon twelve. But student, twenty-three upon twelve is improper fractions. So we will convert it into mixed number. So students, if we convert it into mixed number, then denominator twelve will remain twelve ones are twelve, and twenty-three minus twelve is eleven. So you can count now twelve ones are twelve plus eleven is twenty-three. So this is the answer. J. One upon two plus one upon three plus one upon six. Here also all three denominator we will first of all take LCM. So LCM of two, three, and six we will take two, three, six. So students two ones are three, two threes are three, one one. So what LCM answer we are getting here six. Now we will make denominator six. One upon two multiply by three upon three. Three ones are three, two threes are six. Then one upon three multiply by two upon two. We will do two ones are two, two threes are six. We get the denominator. This one upon six is already with the denominator six, so we will not not make same because it is already in six. Now we'll write all three fractions: three upon six plus two upon six plus one upon six. So here also we get the like fraction six, two, three, one, 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 one
थ्री प्लस टू प्लस वन थ्री प्लस टू फाइव प्लस वन इज सिक्स सो सिक्स अपॉन सिक्स नाउ स्टूडेंट्स ही आर ऑल्सो द नंबर्स आर सेम फ्रैक्शन आर सेम सो सिक्स वन जै सिक्स वन जै सो आंसर इज वन वॉट आंसर वी आर गेटिंग वन क्वेश्चन नंबर के इन क्वेश्चन नंबर के इट इज वन इंटीजर वन अपॉन थ्री प्लस थ्री इंटीजर टू अपॉन थ्री दिस इज इन मिक्स नंबर फर्स्ट ऑफ ऑल वील कन्वर्ट इट इन टू इम प्रॉपर फ्रैक्शन थ्री वन जै थ्री प्लस वन फोर अपॉन थ्री प्लस थ्री थ्री जै नाइन प्लस टू इलेवन अपॉन थ्री नाउ स्टूडेंट्स हियर यू कैन ऑब्जर्व वन थिंग दैट बोथ आर अ लाइक फ्रैक्शन बोथ आर लाइक फ्रैक्शन सो वी कैन यू वील नॉट टेक कैल्सियम थ्री इज देर एंड फोर प्लस इलेवन सो फिफ्टीन अपॉन थ्री Now here three ones are three fives are so we get answer as five. Question number L. Four integer two upon three plus three integer one upon four. So we will convert this first mixed number into improper fraction. Four three is at twelve plus two fourteen upon three plus three four is at twelve plus one thirteen upon four. Here we have to take LCM because they are unlike fractions. So LCM of three and four we will take. So three and four, two two zero, two one zero and three one zero. So what LCM answer we are getting? Two two zero four four three zero twelve. So LCM equals to twelve. Now we will uh, make the denominator same fourteen upon three. So we will multiply by four upon four. So fourteen four za is fifty six upon twelve, then thirteen upon four. So we will multiply by again three upon three. Thirteen three za thirty nine upon twelve. Now we will add both the fractions fifty six upon twelve plus thirty nine upon twelve. So if we add fifty six plus thirty nine, then answer we are getting is ninety five upon twelve. Now this is also in improper fractions. So we will convert it into mixed number. Twelve is our denominator. Twelve seven is eighty four. Eighty four plus eleven is ninety five. And the answer is seven integer eleven upon twelve. Now number M. Sixteen upon five minus seven upon five. So students here you can observe both are like fractions. So here we will write. Five because denominators are same. Sixteen minus seven. Sixteen minus seven is nine upon five. This is again improper fraction, so we will convert it into mixed number. Five ones are five plus four is nine. So one integer four upon five is answer. And number. Question number n. Four upon three minus one upon two. These are unlike fractions. So here we will take LCM of three and two. So here LCM if we take three and two, then two ones are three ones are. So LCM equals to two three is a six. Now we will make denominator as six. Four upon three multiply by two upon two that is eight upon six. And one upon two multiply by what we will do? Three upon three that is three ones are three three upon six. Now, students, we will do subtractions because subtraction sign is given. Eight upon six minus three upon six. Both are like fractions, so six, eight minus three, and that is five upon six. So answer is five upon six. This is proper fraction. Question number two. Sarita bought two upon five meter of ribbon and Lalita three upon four meter of ribbon. What is the total length of the ribbon they bought? Now here. Sarita and Lalita bought some fractions of the ribbon. Total length is r, so so we will do additions of these fractions. Solution: Sarita bought two upon five meter of ribbon. Lalita bought three upon five meter of ribbon. The total length of the ribbon they bought equals two. So we will do total length that is two upon five plus three upon four meter. Now, students, these are unlike fractions. So, like earlier questions, we will solve it by taking LCM. So, we will take LCM of five and four. 
so 5 and 4 lcm if we'll take then 2 five 2 here yeah, 5 lcm 2 2 za 2 1 and 5 1 za now lcm equals to what answer we are getting 2 2 za 4 4 5 za 20 so lcm equals to 20 now students we will write here 2 upon 5 multiply by what we will take students here by 5 which number we will multiply to get 24 we will multiply by 4 so 4 upon 4 2 4 are 8 5 4 are 20 then next is 3 upon 4 now by 4 we will multiply by 5 so we will get 20 so 5 upon 5 3 5 are 15 5 4 are 20 Now total is asked, so we will do addition of eight upon twenty plus fifteen upon twenty. They are like fractions. We can add these two fractions, eight plus fifteen, and that is equals to twenty-three upon twenty. Now students, this is twenty-three upon twenty. Again, this is which type of fractions? Improper fractions. So here, students, we will convert it into mixed number. Twenty is denominator. One integer three upon twenty is the fractions. So let us write answer. So the total length of the ribbon they have equals to what? One integer three upon twenty meters. So this much total length of the ribbon they have. Question number three. Naina was given one integer one upon two pieces of cake. And Nazma was given one integer one upon three pieces of cake. Find the total amount of cake given to both of them. So here, this is the question of cake. Both are having some fractions of cake. We have to find total amount. How much they both have? So here also we will do addition. So here, Naina was given one integer one upon two of the cake. Nazma was given one integer one upon three of the cake. Now total cake given to them equals to what will the students here one integer one upon two plus one integer one upon three. We have to add them because total is asked. First of all, we will convert both the mixed number into improper fractions. One two is a two plus one three upon two. Three one is a three plus one four upon three. They are unlike fractions. We will take LCM of two and three. So if we take LCM of two and three, two ones are three as it is three ones are. So LCM equals to two threes are six. LCM equals to six. So now we will make denominator same. That is six. Three upon two multiply by three upon three. Three threes are nine. Nine upon six. Four upon three multiply by two upon two, so four to the eight and three to the six. Both the side fractions we get six. Now we will add nine upon six plus eight upon six. So students here we have to add both the number nine upon six plus eight upon six. They are like fractions, so nine plus eight upon six, seventeen upon six. Again, this is improper fractions. So we will convert it into mixed number. That is equals to two six that twelve plus five. So two integer five upon six. Now let us write answer. So they together were given two integer five upon six of the cake. Both of them are having two integer five upon six of the cake. Question number four. Fill in the blanks. A dash minus five upon eight equals to one upon four. Now, students, here suppose we want to find this dash. So here we can use like uh, equations form L minus m equals to n. Suppose these are the numbers. Now here I want to find L. So L equals to what? I will do n plus m. Means what, student? If I shift this minus m to the next side, then sign will change. Same way here we will find. So this blank is suppose our l, and I want to shift this because I want to find this blanks. So dash minus five upon eight equals to one upon four. If I do, that is dash equals to one upon four plus five upon eight. I will do. 
now students this 4 and 8 are unlike fractions so we will take lcm of 4 and 8 so 4 and 8 lcm if we take 2 2 z 2 4 z 2 1 z 2 2 z 2 1 z 1 z lcm we get 8 5 upon 8 is already in the denominator 8 so we will make this as same 1 upon 4 multiply by 2 upon 2 plus 5 upon 8 that is 2 upon 8 plus 5 upon 8 now students here 2 plus 5 is 7 upon 8 so what answer we are getting in blank 7 upon 8 so students you can check 7 minus 5 is 4 up is 7 minus 5 is 2 upon 8 and its simplest form is 1 upon 4. Question number B. Dash minus 1 upon 5 equals to 1 upon 2. Here also if we take L minus M equals to N. Therefore L equals to N plus M. So here dash minus 1 upon 5 equals to 1 upon 2 is there. That is dash equals to 1 upon 2 plus 1 upon 5. Now if we find LCM of 5 and 2, then 2 and 5 LCM if we find 2, 1, 0 and 5, 5, 1, 0, 1, 0. So what is the LCM? 10. Now we will make denominator as 10. 1 upon 2 multiply by 5 upon 5 plus 1 upon 5 multiply by 2 upon 2. Why we have done this? Because here we got the LCM as 10. So we have make the denominator same. So dash equals to what? We get 5 upon 10 plus 2 upon 10 that is equals to what student 5 plus 2 is 7 upon 10 so your answer we are getting is 7 upon 10 so students in this blank we are getting answer as 7 upon 10 so let us see let us check here also we will take LCM 5 to 0 and 1 multiply 2 so 7 minus 2 is 6 upon 10 7 minus 2 is 5 upon 10 and 5 1s are and 5 2s are. So this is the simplest form of 5 upon 10. Question number C. Now in question number C it is 1 upon 2 minus dash equals to 1 upon 6. So students here also if we take A minus B equals to C. Then student we will if we want to what we want to find here these blanks. That is minus B equals to we want to find. So, your students we can take as B equals to A minus C. Why? Because this minus B we want to find as B. We will find B equals to A minus C. That means what student? Here 1 upon 2 minus dash equals to 1 upon 6 is given. That is 1 upon 2 minus 1 upon 6 we will do. Again what we have to do LCM of 2 and 6 is what? 6. So we will make denominator same. Here 2 is that. So we will take 3 upon 3. 3 upon 6. So 3 upon 6 minus 1 upon 6. That is equals to 2 upon 6. Now if we take the simplest form. We will get answer as 1 upon 3. So here 1 upon 3 is the answer. Question number 5. Complete the addition subtractions box. This is the box given. We have to complete this box. 2 upon 3, 4 upon 3, blank. 1 upon 3, 2 upon 3, blank. And all this entire row. This side is additions. This side is subtraction. That sign is given. So let us find for A. First row we will do. If we want to do row, then we have to do addition. So first row, 2 upon 3 plus 4 upon 3 if we do. Then what is the answer? 6 upon 3. That is equals to 2, 3 1s are 3 2s are. So, answer in first row is 2. Now for the second row. So, again addition because this side addition is given. 1 upon 3 plus 2 upon 3. So, here these are like fractions. So, we can add it. 1 plus 2 is 3 upon 3. Can, if we cancel this 3 1s are and 1s are. So, answer is 1. Now, column. First column. For column we have to do subtractions. So we will subtract these two fractions. 2 upon 3 minus 1 upon 3. That is 2 minus 1 is 1 upon 3. These are like fractions. Now second column. 4 upon 3 and 2 upon 3. What we will do? Subtractions. First column answer is 
वन अपॉन थ्री नाउ लेट एस डू सब्ट्रेक्शन फोर अपॉन थ्री माइनस टू अपॉन थ्री सो फोर माइनस टू इज टू अपॉन थ्री सो दिस आंसर इज फॉर सेकेंड कॉलम सो सेकेंड कॉलम टू अपॉन थ्री नाउ स्टूडेंट्स फॉर द थर्ड कॉलम वी कैन डू डायरेक्टली बिकॉज इट्स होल नंबर टू माइनस वन वी विल डू सो यर टू माइनस वन इज वन so for third column what we can find 2 minus 1 that is equals to 1 question number b 1 upon 2 1 upon 3 1 upon 3 1 upon 4 this side additions this side subtractions first of all we will find for first row that is 1 upon 2 and 1 upon 3 additions we will do so 1 upon 2 plus 1 upon 3. Now we cannot add in this directly because they are unlike fractions. So LCM of 2 and 3 is 6. So we will make the denominator 6. So 2 3 is there, there. So we will multiply by 3 upon 3, and here we will multiply by 2 upon 2. So answer is 3 upon 6 plus 2 upon 6. Now we get the like fractions. Answer is 3 upon 6 plus 2 upon 6. Now we get the like fractions. So if we add three plus two upon six, and that is equals to five upon six. So what is the first row? Five upon six. In this B, we will write first row as five upon six. Now for the second row, again we will do addition one upon three and one upon four. So for the second row, one upon three plus one upon four. LCM of three and four is twelve. So now let us find out the Like fractions. So by three, which number we will multiply? Four upon four. So four upon twelve, and by one upon four, which number we will multiply? Three upon three. So three upon twelve. Both the like fractions we get. Four upon twelve plus three upon twelve. That is four plus three upon twelve. That is seven upon twelve. So students, here second row, what answer we are getting? Seven upon. 12. So here we will write answer as seven upon twelve. Now we will find for the column. For column, what we have to do? Subtraction. So one upon two minus one upon three we will do. First column, one upon two minus one upon three. Here also LCM is six, so we will make the denominator same. Three upon three minus one upon three. That is multiply by two upon two. That is equals to we will take here three upon six minus two upon six. That is equals to one upon six. Because now they are like fractions, six six is denominator, so answer is one upon six. So here we will write one upon six. Now one upon three minus one upon four. So for one upon three minus one upon four also we will make denominator same that is twelve. So one upon three multiply by what we will do? Four upon four minus one upon four multiply by three upon three. That is four upon twelve minus three upon twelve. That is equals to one upon twelve. So here also answer is one upon. So here we will write answer as one upon twelve. Third column five upon six seven upon twelve. So here also we will do subtraction. So students five upon six minus seven upon twelve. L C M is twelve. Here it is twelve, but we will make this as twelve. That is we will multiply by two upon two. That is ten upon twelve. Minus we will do seven upon twelve. So ten minus seven is three upon. Twelve. So here that is equals to one upon four. So students' answer is one upon four. So here we'll write one upon four.